Hey, what's up everybody? This is Todd Harrison, founder and CEO of Beat Muscular Dystrophy, and I am officially back promoting muscular dystrophy. Yes, there is a solution for muscular dystrophy, but you have to be willing to have an open mind. Now, yesterday I shared a couple articles, and today I'm gonna show you some more articles. And this time this article is about wheat germ oil. Okay, so this was June 13th, 1956. Muscular dystrophy victim restored by wheat germ oil. A 23-year-old girl made almost helpless by a muscle-wasting disease has been restored to almost normal activity after treatment with wheat germ oil. Dr. Ira Manville of the University of Oregon Medical School reported yesterday. The girl's case, diagnosed several years ago as muscular dystrophy, was reported to the Society for Experimental Biology and Medicine, meeting here with the Pacific Division of the American Association for the Advancement of Science. Dr. Manville said he tried wheat germ oil because investigators elsewhere had used the material to cure muscular dystrophy experimentally produced in rabbits, but the purified wheat germ extract used by the other researchers had no beneficial effect on the disease in humans. He said, a particular brand of wheat germ oil, which supposedly retains natural vitamins and minerals in its makeup was given to the girl. Whether there is some beneficial substance in this particular wheat germ product that does not exist in more highly purified forms of the material remains to be determined. And this was not the only article published Published. Here's a couple more. Wheat germ oil used in muscle disease cure. Wheat germ oil restores girl to normal activity. Wheat germ oil restores girl's health. So you know what, for all of you haters who think I'm a scam or beat muscular dystrophy is a scam, you need to open up your eyes and you know, you need to realize that there is undeniable proof that there is muscular dystrophy cures out there that have been suppressed. Okay, this is wheat germ oil. First, they cured it in rabbits. Okay, Dr. Ira Manville, he got curious and was like, okay, let's try this in humans. What happened? Miraculous improvements. Was there any mass scale human studies after this one reported cure? Absolutely not. Again, if a cure does not come from a pharmaceutical drug, you're gonna have a whole pharmaceutical market be wiped out, especially for muscular dystrophy. And this applies for many other diseases you can go on here on newspapers.com and literally unravel the complete truth to many other diseases. This isn't just for muscular dystrophy, okay? There is plenty of nutritional protocols out there that have some merit to at least try, okay? There's no denying that. So anyways, if you're a hater, this information is not for you and I just wanna let you know I'm going to be doing daily videos and I got a lot more articles to share in the coming days. So thank you for watching this video and also make sure to go on YouTube and subscribe to the official Beat Muscular dystrophy youtube channel i'm going to be doing a couple exclusive videos on there so go ahead subscribe and stay tuned in the coming weeks for more articles